What's going on, everybody? It's James Zapp from the Dapper Den Barbershop in Richfield, Connecticut. And we're not actually in my basement this time. We're actually in the shop getting to do a review. And we're going to be going to do a review on Wall's new profile, The Vanish. So thanks so much for tuning into the channel. Of course, as always, if you're new to the channel, if you go ahead and hit subscribe, like, leave a comment down below, share this video, hit the notifications bell, whatever you got going on, we really appreciate all that. Thank you so much. So Wall just came out with this new profile, the Vanish it's called. And I heard about this when I was at one of the expos, I was talking to the guys that they couldn't really reveal what's going on, but with already they came out with the new gold magic clip. They came out with the new gold lithium ion trimmer. You figure that the next one was probably gonna be the profile. And I didn't know what to think about this when it came out because I was using a Wall uh, finale for a long time. It was one of the first profiles I ever got. So when this came in the mail, super excited to try it out, see what's going to happen. And right out of the box, you can already tell it's a lot sturdier than a finale. It's heavier. It's got a better grip on it. It's got grips on the back, which is really nice. And a little tiny grip on the front, which also doubles as your light to see when it turns on. One cool feature about it is it does have a travel locking system, which you have to just hold it when you turn it on and it will lock, it'll blink three times. And you try to turn it on, it won't. In order to turn it back on, you just have to hold it again. I think it's like five seconds, give or take, around that, and it'll turn back on for you. So if you're a traveling barber and you're worried about your stuff always turning on, I know mine always kind of vibrates in the bag and stuff, so this will not turn on, which is great. Huge feature that they came out with this that I really like is that the gold foils that they have, which are really, really nice, can actually pop out and can be replaced. So these are super easy to do. All you do is just pop them out like so. And if you buy another one or a new one that you wanna pop in, you just pop it in like that. This is super helpful because if people have issues with the foils themselves actually having a crack in it, which can leave a lot of scars on people's faces, this is gonna help out a lot in terms of that because it's gonna take three seconds just to pop one on. And I don't know, cause I haven't checked out the price yet of how much the gold foils are, but I'm assuming they're gonna be a lot cheaper than just buying an entire blade top this, you're just buying a foil, probably sell them one or two, you can buy whatever you need and just swap it out real quick. Battery life on this, they're doing a lot more. It's lithium ion, like everything is, and it's got a hundred, plus minutes of runtime, which is really, really good, especially if you're just always charging it like you should be. But that could pretty much get you through a whole day because you're not using a profile the whole time during a haircut. You're only using just to clean up the neck or maybe do a quick shave on somebody. But I am super excited that they finally came out with a better, it's just more solid. If you like the finale, you're gonna love this a lot more because it's just a sturdier profile. This, this is exactly, if you love the finale, you're gonna love this even more. It's worth every penny of that. If you're already using a finale or the, the super close red one, I think it's also called the finale. It might be something shaver, super shaver, whatever it's called. I'll look that up and leave it up here somewhere. This is a really, really nice profile that they came out with. I do like it. The only thing that I would say that I would think would be really cool if they did, I can understand why they didn't, but with the new Magic Clip Gold they came out and the Lithium uh, Ion Trimmer, they both came with stands, which was super helpful. And they were really sturdy, sturdy stands. This does not come with a stand, unfortunately. That would have been really cool. Again, I think Wall's the only people that are putting stands other than I think maybe a couple other companies are putting them. But Wall started putting these heavy duty stands in with their clippers and trimmers, which was cool. And that would have been really cool to have for a pro foil. I don't think any company's doing that though. So that's my only real critique about the entire thing. Overall, again, coming from the first profile I ever used was a finale moving to this. This is awesome. Super cool, good grip, solid battery life, good power on it. Really crisp lines you can get on doing somebody's neckline or something like that. And of course, one thing I didn't talk about, I always talk about necklines, but this for bald fades or skin fades, whatever you want to call them, is really helpful because if you're trying to get out that bottom line, this is super easy because it's a little it's a little heavier and you feel like you have more control. It's kind of hard to explain, but it, for my bald fades or skin fades, it seems a lot easier to use this than other profiles I've used in the past. So that's pretty much it. That's the new wall vanish that came out. Uh, I just got this in the mail. Thank you so much, Wall, for sending it to me. I'm super excited to be using this. This is awesome and I love everything you guys are coming out with. I don't know when this will be on the market, depending on when you're watching this video. I think it's coming out in December sometime. I'm not 100% sure, but if you want to check them out, you can just go to wallpro.com. I'm going to leave the website down there. 
Also, if you want to check out our website, you can go to the Dapper Den Barbershop .com. Check out our website, follow us on all the Instagrams, give us a like, give us a comment, give us a subscribe, give us a follow, give us a TikTok, Tic Tac, whatever the hell it is. Do all that, we'd greatly appreciate it. Thanks so much for watching and stay tuned for more videos.